boasting about committing crimes on the internet doesn't pay. 14 members of a Brooklyn gang were busted after idiots in their crew accepted Facebook friend requests from a cop who was tipped off to their year-long Crown Heights crime wave, authorities said. Police officer Michael Rodriguez, an anti-crime officer, friended several alleged members of the Brower Boys gang through the social networking site. Cracking the gang's coded online chatter, cops were then able to set up surveillance of the thieves stepping out onto fire escapes and up to rooftops to make their escape. In one police surveillance video from March, an alleged gang member identified as Olurabu Henry can be seen in broad daylight as he carries a backpack out a window and onto a rooftop where cops were waiting for him. Looks like they're passing stuff out. Going back up to the roof, Sergeant's so coming right to you. Just one. In the black hoodie right now, he's coming out right now. Henry's still inside. Up on the roof, wait till he's coming to you. Police said the wave of more than a dozen break-ins terrorized Crown Heights residents from April 2011 to March of this year. At a press conference, Police Commissioner Ray Kelly said that the Bower Boys would target people who had just moved into the neighborhood and look for open windows to crawl into. Two of the break-ins turned violent, authorities said. In one, Darren Dyson, Deshaun Samuels, Christopher Scott, and a 13-year-old boy are accused of tying up a man and a woman during a robbery and sexually assaulting the 22-year-old female. In another, Terry Wally allegedly shot the resident of one home he was burglarizing, then suffered a self-inflicted gunshot wound during the struggle with the victim. This is Peter Kong for the New York Post. Henry's up the roof. He's going. He's hopping the... And he's going to be... Sarge is coming right down the same way as you. 